What's up guys, it's Steven here, and um, you know, I just had to make a new channel and uh, just review stuff and uh, show you how I, what I like to do in my daily life besides, you know, gaming and doing gaming channels, so. Um, uh, something about myself, I'm a huge snapback collector, I, uh, I'm a big fan of snapbacks. You know, I don't wear much because um, I got a small head, so they don't really look that good at me, like, um, you know, they, they don't really look that good on me. Now, um, I could, you know, I could rock them. You know? I Sometimes I rock them, but I just like the way they look. And, you know, sometimes I put them on. Now, this one here on review is the Los Santos Grand Theft Auto V's New Era Adjustable Snapback. This, uh, if you're wondering with where I got this from, and if you're wondering, I have never seen this before. That is because it came with the Grand Theft Auto V Collector Edition. And, um... You could only get it in the collector edition. Now, you could simply, if you really wanted to, I bought the collector edition for a reason because I'm a huge Grand Theft Auto 5 fan. Now, if you wanted to, you can actually just go get a, a you know, a regular blank black snapback or white, whatever, whatever color you want. And you can actually take it to um, Lids. There's a place called Lids here that actually does custom printing on your hat. So you can actually give, give um, them a, a regular snapback, get them to print Los Santos on it. And you'll have a Los Santos hat. But this one here is made by Rockstar. It uh, has the Grand Theft Auto 5 logo right there. Which I'm not too fond of. Like, um, if you look at it from afar. You have the the nice, nicely stitched Los Santos. The thread, the threading is really well, well done. You could, uh, it, you can tell it's not, um, it's not cheaply made. It's not just cheaply put together. You, it's, it's really well made. The stitching looks nice. The the lettering looks really good. The font size is good too. It fits on the hat perfectly. Uh, it's not too big. It doesn't go too high up. It's somewhere in the middle. And um, there's also a little a little thin line of uh, black stitching in the back behind the letters, which uh, makes which really stands out on the hat when you look at it from afar. Um, the sticker says "New Era Adjustable." Now, as I was saying about the logo, so when you look at the hat from afar. You see, uh, if you want to look at the front, if you're wearing it on, if you're wearing it forward, it looks like that. And let's say you turn your head, and all you see is the logo. Now, I'm not too fond of the green Grand Theft Auto 5 logo there, and I understand it's for promotional pr purposes and they want to promote their game. But um, when you're wearing the hat, and you're wearing a black and white hat like this, and you turn to the side, and all of a sudden, it's just a mix, a mixture of green. Um, it's stitched in there. It's stitched in there, as you can see. So it stands out. Uh, the green, the green stands out, then the, and it says five. So it like, it just, it just stands out really weird. If, if, even if you put on an angle like this, you can see how much it stands out. Now some people might not mind this, and some people, um, some people, actually, mind it a lot, and they, and they didn't want this hat just because of the stitching. Now uh, I, I rarely wear this hat outside. I'm, I use it more of a collect, uh, a collection, collector purposes. I just put it on my wall. Um, <clears throat> uh, but if people don't like this lettering here, this this uh, Grand Theft Auto 5 logo, then you guys can do exactly what I said earlier and uh, just get a regular black plain hat, bring it to a, a custom you know a custom clothing place or lids if if you have a lids there, and tell them to customly print Los Santos in like a com <clears throat> a Compton Compton type of font. So Los Santos. Uh, so you turn it behind. If you if you wear it like this. You know, just just a regular it looks like a regular generic snapback from the back. Uh, so I mean, if you if you put this part in the in the front and this part in the back, and then it looks like this, and you wear it this way, looks good. Um, another thing is, uh, it has uh, a rear, it's not really visible. It has a Rockstar logo right there. Also, very well well made and nicely stitched in there. Um, that one is not really noticeable, as you can see it, right now. It can't you can't really see it. Then you put in the light, you could see it. So no one notices that when you were in the hat. That logo though stands out very much. So <clears throat> the inside of the hat has um, just a whole bunch of new new era new era symbols. Just says new era all over the hat. Try and get the focus there. Yeah, just says new era all over the hat. Um, but no one really, no one really looks inside the hat, so um, you won't have to worry about that. Even if it is ugly, you don't no one's gonna see it anyways. Uh, tells you new era. Um, a little little um, where it's made. Uh, one size fits all or fits most because you know it's snapback and um, then just a company sticker right there with the date 
Uh, reason this, reason it says one size fits most is because if it says one size fit all, then it should fit anyone. But when I put it on my head, because I have a small head, um, it it looks kind of big on me, right? I have to literally um, put it to I think right here. I have to like make it pretty tight. I have to I have to close it pretty tight for it to fit like, nice and snug on my head. But yep, that's the that's the Los Santos snapback. I'll I'll, I'll sh I have a lot more snapbacks. I'll show you them. Um, some of them are uh, you know. Uh, what's it called? Um, official, like officially stickered. Some of them are just really cheap ones that I found, and uh, but I just like d the design on them, so I'll definitely show you those. But for now, that's the Los Santos snapback. So if you're thinking of getting it, uh, the collector edition just for the snapback, um, my my final verdict would be to try and find the hat sold separately. Uh, it's not really worth picking up the whole collector edition just for the hat. Uh, try and find the hat sold separately. You can probably find it on. Amazon or eBay or or a, a Craigslist or something, but make sure you get a good price. So I'd say I'd say twenty five, thirty dollars maybe for a hat like this, for the Los Santos thing. And if you really wanna, if you really can't find one, then just make it then custom custom make it. And I think custom making it would be a little more than actually buying the hat, maybe thirty five dollars forty. But uh, if you really want one, yep, just do that. And that's the review on the hat. Uh, tell me in the comments what you thought and. Um, like this video, subscribe for more view videos. I'm gonna try and upload some more reviews on this channel, vlogs, skits. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see what I can do. For now, I wanted to just show you uh, my review on the snapback because ever since I got the game, I didn't really review it. So I'm gonna review the snapback. And uh, yeah, that's my that's my thoughts on it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you I helped you guys out.